Right then, in this video, we go to this building with 11 floors. So, kind of mediumish building, not particularly tall, and it's only residential. And you don't normally get the high spec lifts in residential, it's only got 11 floors, and it's in a fairly small town where not much happens. So, this is not going to have a prestigious lift. Might as well walk past it and not go in it. Well, definitely don't walk past because what it has was absolutely shocking. Before I tell you what lift this has, let's just remind ourselves of Elephant and Castle with 38 floors of gen. Two shitness. 38 floors and with a 1.6 meter a second Gen 2. Absolutely horrible. Gen 2s are rubbish lifts. For a couple floors, if you get a high spec model, we're kind of reasonable. But even the top spec model is not that good. And for 38 floors, utter disgrace. Now, with that said, 11 floor building in a little town where not much happens. And it has a 3.5 meter a second eco disc with a heavy duty chassis and good acceleration. 3.5 meter a second for 11 floors. That is crazy. 11 floors. Let's see how fast the cone goes. You'd expect a 1 meter a second, but watch this. Still speed up, still speed up. And just as so it gets to top speed, it starts sliding down again from the floor. That went 3.5 to 4 meter a second for 11 floors. I've never seen anything like this. Runs at 3.5 meters a second. This is, this is wow. <laughs> Acceleration's good. Woo! Oh, just reach top speed, about 3.5. And now it starts slowing down again. To a complete and utter stop. <laughs> this is fucking epic. And it's the UK. You'd expect, maybe Switzerland to have something that's good as this. The UK. This is England. Yeah. So let's go into the most room and it gets even weirder. This lift I was expecting to have a MX32 because it takes 1,500 kilograms and goes 3.5 meters a second. That must be far beyond what an MX18 has, surely? Well, no, it's actually got an MX18. Considering an MX18 is usually has roughly the same power as the MX20. How on earth can it go 3.5 meters a second? But not just that, how does it go 3.5 meters a second and take 1,500 kilograms? An MX20 at 1,500 kilograms would only go about 1.6 meters a second. On MX20 plus the high kilowatt version, maybe about 2 meters a second or possibly 2.5 but how can this lift with MX-18 go 3.5 meters a second at 1,500 kilograms? This must be a very high kilowatt version of the MX-18 and it must be very pushed to its limits. The amount of forces on this little tiny motor for such a big lift. I don't know how Code have done this, but wow.
the top floor. So that's the MX-18 High Power Edition ticked off, in the next video is the MX-32.